you know, and they're a fragile team too. We saw that against Vegas. So hopefully they can put together a good effort tonight. It should be a good one. This one is underway. Hoffman takes the puck in. He had one of the two goals in that overtime loss against the LA Kings a couple nights ago. Puck played in deep. Fed back in front, bouncing puck. There's a shot stopped by Markstrom. His Lekkonen had a pretty good look. Markstrom had to be sharp to make his first save in the hockey game. Dubé on the wing tonight. Lewis carries in, puts a shot on goal. Allen makes the save, puts the rebound to the corner. Shillington tips it back to the line. There's Lewis, takes a look. They score! Tipped in front, a redirection by Backlund standing right in front. Game all set up nicely for you. And this isn't a complicated play. This is just get the puck to the point. Cleaned up by Toffoli, and he'll bring the puck out for Montreal as he gains the blue line. Toffoli shoots in. That's gobbled up and hung on to. A little shake and bake yep. coming in on the right side. Anderson puts the puck off the boards. Tipped ahead to Gaudreau, and he'll carry in. Shoots on Allen. He fights it off. Lost the rebound, but gets help from teammates. And now Armia. Played in by Belzeal. Right to Markstrom. He'll leave it in the crease. Kept on side. Kulak, former flame, able to back it deep. Now it's fed up the boards as... Throwing at the body was Pizzetta. A pretty big deal. He wore 28 at the time. Guys, I'm saying 28 to the Raptors here in Montreal. What do you <laughs> yeah, think? Well, start the campaign. <laughs> hashtag on Twitter. Conroy to the Raptors. He's on the trip, by the way. Just saw him a moment, a couple minutes before the game starts. But so far, so good at the start of this season. They put themselves in a really good spot right there with Edmonton. Gallagher with a steal and a shot. Markstrom makes the save. It simplifies his game. He knows where he's got to be. Here's a chance of Art shoots and a club save by Markstrom as he snags that and hangs on. David Savard one more time. There's a one-timer that whistles wide as Sherratt leaned into that one. Hoffman hustles over. Fires it in front. Somehow that stayed up and he's going to rebound. Sherratt racing in and it's a 1-1 game. All Canadians, their number one line and Ben Sherratt who had this heater that missed the net and good on Hoffman to get over to the wall and literally get there to keep that in the zone. That thing was ripping along the boards. He keeps it in, and the fake shot into the middle of the ice, and the tip by Suzuki, and then Defoley gets a backhand stab at it, and I think that's what comes over the top of the net, lands in the crease, and the guy who started the whole thing walks right in and taps it into the net, and we got a 1-1 game here with 10.30 to go. Unsuccessfully, Monaghan feeds it ahead. Coleman brings it out. Three flames to center. Blake Coleman to Monaghan. Monaghan back across. Mangiapane scores on the backhand. What a play as he worked it off his foot to the stick. Goes upstairs on Allen. And Andrew Mangiapane makes it 2-1 Calgary. You got another eight to add to it. This is his eighth goal on the road, but leads the, which leads the National Hockey League. And it just shows the talent of Mangiapane. He's able to take a pass that isn't perfect and make it work. I mean, this puck is a good six, eight inches in front of his front toe. And not only does he stop it, he's able to put it in the right place so that he can get it to his stick and then make a real good shot. Hockey moment for themselves. And you, they translated that right into their league this year. And good on Mangiapane. I mean, just seeing that goal just shows you his skill sets. And here he is on the attack right off the draw. There's Tanev with a backhand that's deflected into the corner. Period two is underway. Glad to have you with us on Telus Flames Hockey. Richardson down, back on his feet. Leaves the puck for Lucic. Bank pass back to Tanev. Survey shoots, deflected, fought off by Allen. Rebound cleaned up by Pitlick. Feeds it back to Shillington. Pat saved by Allen. Tanev. Feeds it down low for Richardson. Team doesn't score a lot of goals. You just can't afford to allow that third one. It's just the nature of the beast that the Montreal Canadiens are facing, and he does a great job making two wonderful saves. That one from Shillington from the point came right off of one that redirected off a couple of shin pads, and he tracked it right across, and the Montreal Canadiens were able to get it out of harm's way. Gallagher battling with Tanev. Capoli gets it free. Fed across here. Suzuki stopped by Markstrom. Got the glove on that and swatted it away, and then Branson there to fire it down the ice. Chris Weidman across to Tyler Capoli on the half boards now for Mike Hoffman. Back to Weidman. Here's Suzuki on the other side. In front of the pass, and that deflected just wide off Capoli. Didn't miss by much. Weidman again. Suzuki. Passing. Tip. Hoffman gets it. Weidman shoots. Off the post. And he's going to rebound. And I'll tell you, I think it worked here. They had a lot of cross seam passes. There's one that Lindholm couldn't stop. And eventually, 15 seconds left in the coincidental minors. Zadorov to Rasmus Anderson. 
Off the boards for Kachuk. He'll work it in with Gaudreau going to the front of the goal. Kachuk cuts to the middle. Shoot stop by Allen. Good chance by Kachuk and a nice save by Jake Allen. Kachuk out front. Pat across. Here's Gaudreau. Stop by Allen. Came out to challenge on the setup. Gaudreau with a good look. And Allen's able to make the save and cover up. And then a good job by Gaudreau to have patience and wait it out. Because Monahan knows where he is. These guys know exactly where they are on the ice. Romanov pressured. Grabs on to Mangiapane, spins him around. That allows a teammate to get the puck and fire it down to Mangiapane as a word for the referee. In the meantime, Evans onto the puck. Threw it in front. Nice stop, Markstrom off Suzuki on a short-handed chance for Montreal. Play, but Markstrom misplays his puck. It jumps over his stick, and Evans gets to it first. And before he went to get the puck, you could see him take a quick look. Third period is here. First game of this season high seven game road trip for Calgary and first meeting of the season with Montreal they saw a lot of each other all the Canadian teams did last year nine meetings to Foley plays it deep and Branson got away from him rolled over the stick of Hoffman at the line and here goes Coleman trying to break in two on one but Hoffman recover with a good play to Suzuki has a step Suzuki cuts around scores Great penalty killing that Calgary's had. I'd say there's no way. Coleman gets pickpocketed by Hoffman. Hoffman goes to Suzuki. To Branson, keeps him on the outside. Remember, Suzuki's a right-hand shot, so he's got a really crappy angle from out that way. But the minute he cuts below the goal line... And now it's back the other way to Foley with Hoffman going to the goal. There's the pass. Hoffman stopped by Markstrom. Tried to bank it off. Markstrom cut it off. And Lewis on the loose puck, bottom of the circle, gets some help from Dylan Dubé, who's able to settle it down. And Down these last two and a half minutes. Backlund wins the draw, gets it back to Hannafin, tries a shot on goal, stops, rebound, a great save, Allen! And the loose puck played to the line, great chance there for the equalizer. Chris Tannen's on the puck, up the wing to Gaudreau, tipped in deep. Allen stops that behind the net, off the glass to the line, off to Foley. He'll get it out with the empty net. Here goes Evans. Evans with Gallagher in front. Off Gallagher's stick. But we're inside 10 seconds left. And there's an empty net goal. As Evans fires it in, the Flames complained bitterly there was a trip on the play. Make a play to Gallagher. And there's the trip that Anderson's looking for on Hannafin. As Montreal with a third period goal in the power play. Winds up the game winner. They add the empty netter and a 4-2 Montreal win. Calgary Flames look to bounce back in Toronto against the Maple Leafs tomorrow.